In this video I'm going to show you how to do basic operations with complex numbers, so rectangular or polar conversions and back again using a Casio FX82MS calculator. So, basically when we've got um, the 0.34, you're specifying this in Cartesian or rectangular form, this corresponds to the number 3 plus 4i, and this point here can either be represented by going along 3 and up 4, or by some line of length r at an angle theta. And so if we want to convert 3 plus 4i into um, polar form, we will need to find this r and this theta. So what we want to put into the calculator is pol, which is a polar function, 3, 4. And this is very simple to do. So we just access this polar button, which is here. So I give this pol in the open bracket. Then if we put in 3, and there's a comma on the first row of these type buttons, and then we press 4, and we close the bracket, and you press equals, we get 5. So this is our R value. Notice we've got a 3, 4, 5 triangle here. So if that's 3 and that's 4, that's obviously going to be 5. 3 squared plus 4 squared square rooted is, of course, 5. Um, the calculator stores the theta value in this memory location F, see these red buttons, so to access that we're pressing RCL which is the recall and then if we go to look at all these red numbers A, B, C, D, E and we want F at the end, that gives us 53.1 degrees and so that's how we convert um, from rectangular to polar. Of course if you wanted to go the other way just follow exactly the same steps except for using the um, rect instead of the polar, so that's shift, rect, so say we put in what we had before, 5, then put in a comma, and then uh, 53.1, close that, and then if we press equals, it gives us 3 point something, it's the rounding on this 53, and then if we press recall and then F, we get roughly 4, so that's how you can do some basic operations with complex numbers. Hopefully this is helpful to you and thank you very much.